MZRA Nation, Jamie here. Today, we're talking about winds aloft, and I wanna share some tips with you to help with your winter weather flying. Winds aloft are forecasts that show the expected winds and direction at various altitudes, usually starting at 3,000 feet above ground level. In winter flying, these winds are especially important because they influence your ground speed, field planning, and the timing of encounters with cold fronts or storm systems. Winds aloft are not the same as surface winds, so they won't tell you about gusts or icy conditions at the runway, but they will help you anticipate areas of turbulence and rapidly changing weather while flying. Let's jump into my weather planning app now so I can show you how to find and how to use the winds aloft to help better plan your winter weather planning. Okay, so right here I'm logging into the Aviation Weather Center and I'm gonna go over to the products and go down to the winds and temp data. For today, I know there's some winter weather up in the northeast, so I'm gonna go ahead and select the northeast. Six hours is fine, and I'm gonna do the low level and load the data. Winds aloft not only tell us about wind speed and direction at different altitudes, but they also provide us clues about potential turbulence. When the wind direction or speed changes significantly over a relatively short vertical distance, it indicates wind shear, which can create turbulence in the air. By reviewing the winds aloft before the flight, Pilots can anticipate turbulent areas and plan altitudes to minimize exposure, which is especially important for comfort, safety, and managing aircraft performance. For example, at Phillipsburg in this image, identified by PSB, the temperature is one degree Celsius at 9,000 feet. You better believe I have concerns about icing if I was operating in the clouds in that area. Using winds aloft effectively allows you to make smarter, safer decisions, especially when flying in challenging winter conditions. Make checking them part of your weather briefing next time you go fly. We'll see you next time, and thanks for tuning in for more M0A content.